Hey there. That ice cream looks delicious. Is that strawberry? Know why it tastes so good and looks so delicious? Let's figure it out with STEM. Your tongue has millions of sensory cells that capture and send taste information. Sensory cells are very fine-tuned biological sensors. Your smartphone has technical sensors. It can recognize your finger with its touchscreen, colors with its camera, or GPS data with its antenna. The data comes from satellites and shows you where you are on Earth. The Earth is a tiny planet with a radius of only 6,370 kilometers. You might think you're eating your ice cream peacefully, but actually you're racing around the sun at 30 kilometers per second. The sun is at the center of our solar system, which is part of the Milky Way. That's a galaxy with 300 billion suns. The distances out there are so huge that they're measured in light years because light waves are the fastest thing there is. Using light waves, plants absorb CO2 and produce energy and oxygen. That way, they create the basis for all life on Earth. And ingredients for ice cream. Light allows you to see colors, which are just light waves with specific wavelengths. Light waves are reflected by the ice cream, taken in by your eyes and sent to your brain. And then comes the taste information from your tongue. Happiness hormones are released, and we think, mmm, yum, strawberry. And hormones are, oh, sorry, enough information for now. But as you can see, STEM explains a lot of things. And also, why the same things are sometimes solid and sometimes, ah, uh, liquid. All right, I'll buy you a new one. Goal 4 of the Sustainable Development Goals, Quality Education, describes STEM and STEAM curriculum. There are currently two educational approaches to teaching children in the U.S., the STEM curriculum and the STEAM curriculum. STEM focuses on educating students in four specific disciplines, science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. STEM incorporates these principles into a cohesive paradigm that encourages motivation, engagement, and employs real-world applications. STEAM adds the arts to education and uses the five points to guide student inquiry, dialogue, and critical thinking. STEM supporters believe that curriculum naturally involves the arts. Examples include product design and the communication skills needed for language arts. STEAM supporters say incorporating the arts into the other disciplines devalues arts importance. These two forms of teaching are not too different from each other. Exploring opportunities where art naturally fits into the STEM narrative can help create a healthy balance. Treating art as an applied subject, such as math and science, will give students a new discipline to learn that can also be applied to real-world situations. Design classes can help students learn how to create logos and organize information into presentations. Performing arts, like drama and speech, can help translate into technical writing and persuasive writing skills, which are abilities used in technology-driven and marketing career fields. Creative planning calls for students to use the right side of their brain to think outside of the box, which can come in handy when needing to create content and innovative thinking. Science technology, engineering, the arts, and mathematics are all important factors that make up the curriculum. Being able to learn about all of them will lead to well-rounded and versatile professionals.